I dare say this could be the first tram ride for either of these. I don't I recall. I don't recall Harry in his time in Melbourne jumping on a tram, and Megan. Uh, I dare say she hasn't jumped on a tram before, but there they go, and uh, well, they're, they're they're on board. There we go. Let's see if they got those Mikey cards ready. Maybe no. someone else is taking care of that for them. Well, they might have extended the free tram zone just for today. Yeah. See, this is another thing. See, uh, I love what they've done here. They've sat on opposite sides of the aisle, which means that. Uh, those people lining either side of the tram tracks can actually get a look. Now, when uh, the Queen and Prince Philip were here seven years ago, they all sat on the one side, which yes. meant everyone who actually waited for hours in the sun on the other side didn't get to see them. Oh, and it she... looks like they've been given a little kawa a little uh, kangaroo there, a little stuffed toy, potentially, that Meghan just wanted to show Harry. She obviously thought that was very cute, of course, with the... Uh, Impending arrival uh, in April next year, we believe, of the royal baby. So lots of presents to take back home uh, for their first baby, which of course was announced on day one of this tour. And what a way to start the tour. Yeah, that's right. And that tram now moving. So this is only going to be, what do you say, about a five minute trip, if that? I think so. I think they are due to be here probably in the next five minutes. So. The tram might be going a little bit slower than usual. If you were the driver, you'd be you'd be uh, taking it pretty easy, wouldn't you? Ah, uh, yeah. So I certainly haven't seen a tram go at this pace before, Alicia. I've got to say. <laughs> and uh, they've got are they uh, policemen on on push bikes? Is it uh, yeah. just uh, ahead of the tram there? So they'll be stopping. So where, where we. Uh, Ah, the beach just behind us there. Well, that line of people that you've been seeing behind us, we'll stay with those pictures, of course, but that line of people you see behind us, that's where they'll stop, basically, where those people have started assembling. And, they've, and they've just stopped traffic here on Beaconsfield Parade, just to make sure that I think there is a smooth run for uh, Harry and Megan to get down here to the beach. And oh, there are some live pictures of, <laughs> wow. Some live pictures they've of some left, live wires. They've left uh, quite the impression, haven't they, on those kids? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they have. Quite so. the story to tell. Yeah, so uh, that tram normally would be chock-a-block at this time of day, wouldn't it? You know, as we're coming up to the end of a working day and people getting home, that would be standing room cheek to jowl, but they've got it to themselves there. And as they just go across one of the busy intersections, which isn't busy today, uh, <laughs> making their way in between the, the beautiful terrace houses of this area, and then they'll come to a stop and then a light, and then it's... Uh, make their way onto the beach. And the celebrations are continuing there at Albert Park Primary School. I think uh, perhaps being on TV is uh, is only slightly topped by uh, by meeting Harry or Megan. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I dare say it will be. So, as we say, the cyclists on push bikes, by the looks of things, they're just uh, acting as an escort for that tram. And I'd love to know who the driver is, and I dare say in the fullness of time we'll find out because that driver, uh, whoever he or she is, will certainly have a tale to tell. And I, I don't know whether they'll get to meet the royal couple. I don't know if the royal couple, they seem to have gone down the back of the tram. Yeah, well, the driver for uh, Queen Elizabeth back in mm. 2011 did get to meet uh, the Queen and the Duke of Edinburgh because they, I think, must have come on the front. So hopefully at the end of the journey, they will uh, get to have a moment to, to meet the driver. But what a thrill anyway. It's, um, it is to be transporting the yeah. Duke and Duchess of Sussex as they make their way down here towards South Melbourne Beach. And you're confident that someone swiped the MyKey card I'm on sure the they machine? Did. I'm absolutely yeah. 100% positive right. they did. They Although, across e it. even if they didn't, I'm pretty sure ticket inspectors won't be getting on board that particular <laughs> tram. <laughs>